Like Murray, play host to occasions like homecoming, the students and alumni are not the only ones who benefit. With over hundreds, maybe even thousands of people pouring into Murray for the weekend's festivities, business has some of the best retail days of the year. Homecoming around the nation brings back people to their alma mater. Local businesses around Murray spoke with us about Murray State's homecoming and how they were prepared. Aaron Carrico, Executive Director of the Murray's Convention and Visitors Bureau, enlightens us on how much planning from the community goes into homecoming weekend, such as hotels, restaurants, and local venue preparations. Well, it all ties together in a huge way. Uh, the Convention and Visitors Bureau is basically um, made off of hotel stays, and so this time of the year we really do our best to put our best foot forward and make sure all of our materials are in the hotels, make sure that we're as welcoming and as friendly as we can possibly be for everyone coming back home. We just try to make sure that our website is as up to date as possible. We want to make sure we have the parade, any, up, any schedules that MSU have put out, make sure we have information about the game and anything that our visitors might need to know while they're here. It would, be, um, it would be a huge detriment to the economy. I mean, it's a week-long event that really, really helps us. The local businesses benefit immensely. You know, the local restaurants, all of them really count on MSU's homecoming yearly. It helps in the way of, you know, when people come back from school, there's places that they want to eat and they want to go and the places they miss. You know, for instance, Dumplings. Everybody wants to go back to Dumplings and get a roll. The same thing with down here on the square. We have unique shops that you can't find anywhere else, so when people come back to visit, they want to be in those places. They want to eat in the same places they ate in college because, you know, it's a memory. And MSU provides great memories, and so that's what homecoming's all about. Boone Chambers, owner and operator of the Big Apple Cafe, told us how word of mouth is important in his business and how people always come back. Homecoming is my busiest weekend of the year, period. Uh, obviously after almost 30 years in business plus the 20 so years it was open before it was the Big Apple as it's known now. Everybody knows the Big Apple. It's a place most of them went when they were in college and most everybody steps back in when they're in for a homecoming. Other than the obvious increase in business, I mean you get a lot of out of town people that do come back you know, for the events that are held at the university, the football game, fraternity, sorority events. Uh, so you see a lot of faces you hadn't seen in years, you know. I mean, the Big Apple is pretty, pretty constant, uh, obviously, you know. All that stuff helps. Any, anything that Murray State does usually affects the Big Apple Cafe. They're kind of intertwined over the years here. So, uh, you know, Love It Live. Uh, Football games, definitely basketball games. Uh, they all have a big impact on how busy we'll be because before and after basketball and football games, people come here and eat and drink and hang out. So yeah, all that stuff makes a, a big difference. The Big Apple probably wouldn't be here without Murray State Universities. Karen Welch, manager of the New Life Christian Center, spoke with us about the excitement homecoming brings to town and also the reconnection at all the events. Homecoming always gears up just a week of festivities and, and that makes it lots of fun because you know that people are coming back. You know you're going to see folks possibly that have been gone for years and some maybe just last year. Uh, every once in a while someone walks in that I went to school with um, since I am an alum of Murray State and that's always fun to be talking and realize, oh my, it's you and we haven't seen each other in um, a lot of years. We will not tell how many. And um, there's so many things about that's just an annual event with homecoming. The parade coming down Main Street and uh, yellow mums everywhere. And um, you know, it's fun to look back and see the changes and people always uh, wanna know what's happened in Murray since they've been here. And so as merchants and as people who get to live here throughout the year and enjoy the university, we know how special this is. I think Murray State's homecoming brings uh, obviously tourism and people from outside and so that's always a boost for the comedy economy. I'm sure the restaurants love it um, and people are doing those kinds of things but they also go shopping um, and they want to see what's changed. Homecoming always brings in many people along with spending money in our local economy. All local businesses benefit from Murray State's homecoming in all aspects throughout the weekend.